Casey, we've been to so many weddings lately that in some ways I still can't believe it's actually ours. But in so many other ways, I've been ready for this moment with you for years. When I thought about what I wanted to share today, my mind immediately jumped to all of the superlatives that people often say. That you are the most beautiful, the funniest, and truly the most caring person I've ever met. And while all of those things are undoubtedly true, the superlative that I ended up wanting to share is actually a decision we made together, and one that comes with a story. As you now know, all of you, uh, Casey and I met, with one, met one another with just only a few weeks left in our undergraduate schools before we had to depart to two different graduate schools that were a few states apart. After just a couple months of dating, we were faced with a difficult decision that turned into an hours long conversation sitting on the dock outside the house I lived in senior year. In case anyone hasn't put it together yet, we did indeed decide that we wanted to commit ourselves to one another and face the challenge of a long distance relationship because we thought what we had found in one another was well worth it. I vow to always cherish and uphold the faithful commitment to one another that we have had ever since. Casey, I can say with certainty that decision we made together that day is and always will be the best decision of my life. Since that day, you have not only made me into a better person, I mean seriously everyone, the type of person that unpacks their suitcase as soon as I get home now, <laughs> but you have also made me happier than I ever thought possible. So Casey, I vow to always strive to make you happier than you thought possible. I vow to tolerate your love for the Ravens, and anyone that knows me well enough should know how serious of a commitment that is. I vow to always show gratitude for every sandwich with a sticky note in my lunchbox, every load of laundry, and the countless other things you do to help me through the busiest times of life. And finally, I vow to never take for granted the amazing love we have found in one another, and I vow to love you unconditionally for the rest of our lives. Ben, from the first day I finally met you, I knew that you were someone special. You came into my life just as my whole world started to change. Yet, remained a constant through all of the chaos. I remember being instantly drawn to your sense of humor, your kindness, and of course your good looks. People talk about how relationships are hard, but to me, our love is the easiest thing. There are so many things I knew about you, like how you interact with people, how you're an amazing teacher to kids and to me, and how you're the best da dog dad to Rocky, even when he's losing his mind. And how you can see the light no matter how dark something is. You are truly the man I've wanted my entire life. And I can't believe I'm lucky enough to be marrying you here today. I can't promise you I'll be perfect. And I can't promise you I'll cook you dinner. But I can promise to try my best every day to be the best possible wife to you. I vow that I'll always laugh at your jokes and I'll stay as goofy as I am today until I'm old and gray. I vow to never let you win at games and try not to be a sore winner. I vow to watch all the sports with you as long as you also watch The Bachelor. I vow I'll always support you and be your biggest cheerleader to encourage you to chase your dreams and to motivate you along the way. I vow to listen to you with compassion and understanding and to speak to you with respect and encouragement. I vow to be your best friend, to keep your secrets, to hold your hand, <laughs> and to always kiss you good morning and good night. Ben, you're my favorite person in the world. I am so excited for our life together. And above all else, I promise to do my best each day to love you more than I did yesterday. Things you are about to place on each other's fingers represent a never-ending love and devotion to each other. The ring signifies a never-ending connection between your two souls, forever connected as one. Traditionally, marriage is marked by the exchange of rings. These rings are an unbroken circle of love signifying your union and your ongoing commitment to each other. The hand you place this ring on today will not stay the same. 
In time, wrinkles will form, calluses will come and go, and different scars may appear. Not only will each of you change physically over time, but internally you will change as well. Your ideas, values, and hopes may change. In 10, 20, or even 30 years, you will change, but your rings, which represent your vows, will be constant. The promise to love, cherish, and respect one another, no matter what life brings, will always be worn on your finger. Your love will be constant as you walk together through life into the unknown. Your rings and your vows will cling to your finger and hold you together no matter what may come. Now please take each other's hands. Casey, I give you this ring as a symbol of my love, and I am choosing you to share my life with you. I promise to love you today, tomorrow, and forever. Ben, I give you this ring as a symbol of my love, choosing you to share my life with. I promise to love you today, tomorrow, forever. With that being stated, put the power vested in me by legally no one. It is with great pleasure that I now pronounce you husband and wife. You may kiss the bride. Woo! Ladies and gentlemen, I present to you for the first time, Mr. and Mrs. Perkins. Pregnant and afraid When that baby graduates And moves too far away When our parents pass away And our own heads turn to gray When all that's left of me Is this song Then I will be Yeah Me to be.